All right, hello, and welcome back to more Fallout 2. In the previous episode, we finished up things here at the den. Uh, we still need to get that car part for Smitty, but that can come later. For now, I will be happy enough with just leaving. If I could remember the way out. Can't exactly remember how to get out of town, isn't it? Up north here. It's north of Bachman. Come on, let's get out of here. And I think the next place I want to go, I don't want to go to Vault City. I think I want to go to Monarch. Although, where is Vault City? Where is it at? Uh, yeah, Monarch's on the way, so I'll go to Monarch first. But this is where I ended up going to get the uh, dynamite that I needed. Do you wish to encounter a group of mole rats? Well, that would give me XP, but no. I'd assume if I was in normal mode, it probably wouldn't give me that option. It would probably just throw me into every encounter. Come on, get to Monarch. You can do it. I got my group of three people now. Yeah, you can see I had a, a tough time exploring to find it. It took me quite a bit, actually. Uh, why do I always come to these towns right in the middle of the night? Jesus. There we go. Let's go to Maiden Street. Alright, and I ended up finding the dynamite in here by talking to this guy. Right here. What can I do for you? I'm looking for a certain item, and I was wondering if I might be able to help me locate it. Uh, what do you have to trade? What can you tell me about this town? What do you do here? What do you do here? That's a good question. Mostly I just run this here trading post, but on occasion I'm the sheriff, mayor, judge, and any other official you can think of. Wow, you must be a very popular fellow to be interested with all these duties. Now nah, I just drew the short straw. Seems I was out getting some supplies when... And when I came back, I found out the town folk went and elected me. Seems no one else wanted the job except for the occasional argument. I really don't have anything, have to do anything, which suits me fine. Can I ask you some more questions? I'm looking for a certain item, and I was wondering if you might be able to help me locate it. We'll spit it out. I can't help you if you don't tell me what you're looking for, and I sure ain't going to stand here and try and guess what you're looking for. I'm looking for the holy geck. Well, you're in luck. I just happen to know where it is. I guess we have some business to discuss after all. Alright, business. Just tell me where I can find the Holy Geck and I'll be on my way. Only business is that you'll tell me where the Holy Geck is located before something bad happens. What do you want for this information? Um, what do you want for this information? Ah oh, yes, what I want. If you hadn't noticed yet, our little farming community is experiencing one of its worst droughts ever. The rainy season was unusually short this year. Our crops are dead or dying. From lack of water, to put it bluntly, our community is on the verge of withering away with our crops. Um, you do know I can't make it rain, right? No, no, of course not. I wouldn't ask you to do something as possible as that. You really can't make it rain, can you? No, of course you can't. Anyway, like I was saying, we're in trouble and we could use your help, okay? There's this farm to the outskirts of town where no farm should be. Some years back it just appeared out of nowhere. Saying that this farm just sprung out over now night yeah right a group of us were out hunting when we noticed the new farm but that wasn't the strange thing soon after some of us got together to visit our new neighbor only to discover that there wasn't anybody there after many months of trying to contact the owners with no success it was decided that the farm must have been abandoned soon after it was built so instead of letting the crops rot in the field young carl moved in that's when things got bad. Carl started to tell stories of seeing strange glowing figures tending the crops and feeding the animals at night. We all laughed at him, thinking he was making up stories. Then one day, Carl stopped coming to town. What happened to him? Did you look for him? Of course we did. Went up there as soon as we suspected something was wrong. He started to tremble violently. The horror. Bodies strewn everywhere. Some crucified while others were left to rot. Out in the sun. I still wake up screaming in the middle of the night from the horrible images I saw that day. So let me guess, you want me to go to this farm and find out what happened? 
Normally, I would just leave that cursed place be, but for some reason, the crop at the farm are still flourishing despite the drought. We'll starve if we don't get food soon. Will you help us rid the farm of these ghosts? What do I get out of this? In return for helping us, I'll tell you where you can find what you seek. Okay, let's seal the deal. Cut off your right pinky finger. Then it's a deal. Show me where this ghost farm is. This farm is about a day's travel northeast of here. He pulls out his map and points to a spot northeast, northeast of Modoc. Come back when you found something. All right. That shouldn't be too bad. You're back. What did you find out? I'll be back when I have to... Ah, I was going to ask him about the town. Damn it. Well... Anything else here? You see a trader. Used to be a prosperous farming town. Anyone here? See townsperson, townsperson. I imagine I'm not going to get much info out of you. See a wooden door? What else is around town? What can we find? Anyone important? A very active old man. My name's Grissom. Welcome to my slaughterhouse. You dropping off or picking up? Guess picking up, I'm interested in buying some travel provisions. Ah, of course, of course. Let's see. For traveling, I recommend our world-famous dried Brahmin strips. Won't spoil on the road, and it's tasty, too. Only ten in a package. You interested? Can I ask you a few more questions? What can I do for you? To buy some of your famous jerky, can you tell me a little bit about the slaughterhouse? I see the drought hasn't affected your business yet. Actually, it kind of helped my business. Nobody had been able to grow sufficient food for their Brahmins, so they are sort of Severely culling their herds, but that's just temporary thing. You have to look at the big picture. With the decline in the Brahmin population, my business can only suffer. Uh, true, true. Tell me a little bit about the slaughterhouse. Not much to tell. I run the slaughterhouse in Modoc. You want something slaughtered, you bring it to me. I'll kill it for you and make it into some of the best jerky you've ever tasted. What about the hides and other parts of the animal? You are quick, aren't you? Well, if you ask, you can retrieve any part of the animal you want. Balthus will usually buy the hides, and Rose will buy whatever scraps you don't want. She uses it to make soup and feed her dogs. I'm going to ask you a few more questions. Uh, I'd like to buy some of your favorite... Okay, never mind. Wait, you look to be a capable traveler. I don't suppose you'd be interested in making some money. That depends how much. What do I have to do? And most importantly, how much? Uh, sure. Great, head out to the pasture at night and kill the pack of wild dogs that are attacking my Brahmin. Come back when you finish the job. Oh, I'm going to be sent right into it then. Okay, where's the wild... Ooh, there's a shit ton of them. Jesus Christ. Doggies? Back off. I don't want to kill all these doggies, but it's got to be done. Poor doggies. But they're attacking the Brahmin. We gotta protect the Brahmin. Well, they don't seem to be attacking me. Ah, there he goes. Brahmin, get away! Oh, jeez, this is gonna be a while, I can imagine, already. Because I'm just gonna be sitting here waiting on each of them. Each turn's gonna take like a minute. Oh, jeez. No, now leave that Brahmin alone. You silly dogs. Get off of him. Jeez, this is gonna be a long battle. Boom. Boom. Oh, jeez. This is gonna be real slow. In fact, I think I slowed the battle, the combat speed down in the menu, so I might, after this turn, seriously hurting the mutant cow. Oh, no. Leave the cows alone. I'll go to preferences. Combat speed is at fastest, actually. Damn it. Never mind. Well, this is going to make things interesting. I have nine. If I did six. Oh, I'm already, already wasted a move.
You wild dogs, come on. Stay put. This is going to be a seriously dumb battle. Leave that Brahmin alone, I tell you. It was critically hit for 10. Ouch. No. There we go. Can get a hit in there. Brahmin, fight back, you have hooves. Come on. There we go. Another one down. Get off that Brahmin! Aww. He got one of them. Damn it, damn it, damn it. How many are over there? Three? Jeez. Probably gonna come over this way, to be honest, though. I'll kill this one next. Or not. Get him. Brahmin, run this way. You bunch of dummies. We got a lot of dumb cows here. Run away, you dumb cows. Oh, come on. Quit missing. Run away, you dumb cows. To be honest, they might be stuck, actually. I noticed that a lot of the uh, NPCs get stuck on walls and trees and shit. So. Where are you going? I did not click over there, did I? I don't think I did. Hit for no damage. Good, good. Does this dog want to be my friend now? I doubt it. You can't hit worth crap, can you, Daniel? You need to get over there. There's two. I think there's. No, there's three of them. But... There's a lot of not getting hit for any damage, which is good in my book, I'd say. Ah, poor doggo. I don't want to kill you. I promise. There he goes. It's a pack of wild dogs. It's gotta be done. Hey, the cows are moving now. Brahmin, run away. Ah, you got another one. There he goes. Yeah, see, they were probably clipped onto this one, unfortunately. Oh, there was four here. They were probably just stuck. Get down. Alright, let's see what happens. There was only two Brahmin out of the whole lot. It shouldn't be too bad. There's another one down. Nope. Nope, not yet. There we go. A serious wound was inflicted. That was a mess. He's down. We've lost three Brahmin now. I wonder how many Brahmin can die before it's a failed mission. There he goes. There's another one. There we go. No, bro. That's, so that's three out of a... Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, three out of ten died. Oh, there's another dog down there. I don't see any others on the map, so... Once we finish up here, we're gonna have to hightail it down there. Oh, missed. Ow. 
He doesn't have a weapon at all. I'm gonna have to get him a weapon of some sort. 75, or this is an 86. There we go. There's one down. I didn't want it to come to this, doggos. Sorry, I had to do this. Goodbye. And we got the last one down here. Where'd he go? There he is. Oh, he's running away. Don't you. Don't run off now. Unfortunately, it's your fault that it's come to this. Oh, he did run off screen. I can't really do anything about that. You are victorious in combat. Oh. What happened? According to the attack on the collar, its name is Bess. Moo. This poor Brahmin is injured. Um. Eh? Failed to heal the Brahmin's broken leg. I can try it a couple times. Failed. Fail. Hopefully I don't fatally injure it. Because I know that's a thing that happens in other Fallout games where you try the doctor's skill and it'll instead fatally injure the thing that you're trying to fix. My doctor's skill might not be high enough. It's only at 30. I could try first aid here in a second, actually. First aid skills won't help heal, right? So I do need a doctor. There we go. You gain 200 experience points. Moo. Grunt. Oh, that's good. Let's see. Who had I talked to? He was in here, wasn't he? Griswold or something. Hey, Grizzly. Yeah, Grissom. How dare you show your face around here? I lost 10 Brahmin due to your... Whoa, 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 what? I saved all your Brahmin. I saved his Brahmin. That's BS. I'll be right back. Brahmin, why are you running towards the wolves? What is your problem? Should be able to hit a couple of them in this next round. Here we go. That's two. I should be able to hit you. There we go. Can I switch? No, apparently not. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Well, I can try and run ahead. Catch up with them now. They won't be able to get as far away. Oh, there's another one. Got smacked. The fact that Brahmin might be stuck. So they all might be staying here anyway. Yep, it looks like it. Now stay off that Brahmin, you bunch of losers. Vic, you're a legend. No, I don't want to do that. There we go, that's another one that's going to be on me. I've got three on me now. The more off the Brahmin, the better. There he goes. Stay off that Brahmin. Miss, miss, miss. Good, good. There's another one that's on me. Can I hit that one? No, I can't quite yet. Just have to walk over here then. And I'll be able to get him in the next turn. Oh, the Brahmin are... Oh, Bess. 
Bess has come to fight. Alright. I did heal her before this battle this time. So. Happy they got one. Damn it, damn it, damn it. But now they're all on me. Alright. This will make things easier then. Boom. Get dead. Best the wild cow. Come to fight for the cow honor. Oh no you don't. He's going after the next one. Can I get over there? I think I can. Good. I missed. Do it, Bess. Good job. It kind of looks like they won't want to fight back, but none of them quite are. Critically lost his next turn? Alright, good, good. Alright, that one just seems to be running off to be doing whatever. Down for the count. Oh, no, he's gonna get away. Vic, he's right there. Hit him. Oh, I don't want him to get down there. No, 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 no. He's gonna run into the, the zone to where I can't get him. Don't come this way. Run the other way. Oh, he actually might be stuck. There we go. It's another one. That wild dog's coming in. No, 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 no! No! It's gonna say I ran out in it. It's gonna say I ran the fuck out when I didn't. It was one and it was on the run. One moment. At least I saved this time. I saved this time. Jesus. This is getting on my nerves. I should really get Vic a weapon. What are you good with? What kind of weapons can you use? I'm pretty good with small arms. I can hit almost any rifle shotgun. Alright. Need, uh... Let's trade, shall we? Because I have quite a few small armed weapons. In fact... There you go. Uh, there you go. Um, you can have all these, I guess. I need to go through and sell those. You can have those. Trade. There you go. So use that weapon I gave you in the next battle. Where's your friend at again? Alright, that's it for now. See if he'll use it in battle. I hope he will. That'd be useful to me. No, that one is attacking me even though I didn't hit him. That one's running off. Leave that Brahmin al Oh, damn it. Is you shot the Brahmin that we're protecting, Vic. You're awful at this. Just words cannot express. Why are you shooting the Brahmin? Oh, they're all after me now. That's good at least. These two are gonna run south now, and I'm not gonna be able to get in front of them. I need them to run back up this way. There we go. I tricked the AI into acting like they could run off. 
but they couldn't. He's gonna run off that way now. And now he's gonna run back up north to me. There we go. No, he's not done yet. Oh, Bess killed him! Is that all of them? Good job, Bess. 